Hey there, by now you know what JEPI is and how JEPI paid dividends. The question is why JEPI's dividends is so low at this point, and I'm going to tell you the exact answer right now. I am not a financial advisor. Please make sure to consult an appropriate advisor and do your own research before making any investing decisions. By now, everyone knows that JEPI is a cover called ETF. And the way they pay dividend is by selling out of the money cover calls and passing that premium to you as a form of dividend. Now, remember what I just said. The way they pay dividends is by selling out of the money cover calls, passing that premium to you. Now, the premium cost or the value of the premium is tied up directly to something called the volatility index. The volatility index is how much the stocks are moving at a certain amount of time. Now, it is crucial where the volatility index is or the VIX. In the following chart, I'm going to show you that the VIX or the volatility is directly tied up to how much dividends JEPI pays. So when the volatility goes up, the dividends goes up. The volatility goes down, JEPI collects less in premium, therefore giving us less or passing less of the premium to us. Now, next time you see that JEPI is paying low dividends, just check the volatility index and you will get your answer. Therefore, settling once and for all why JEPI is paying low dividends. My name is Billy Naguera, and in this channel, I talk about stocks, real estate, finance, and the economy. In this chart, we see the purple lines is the volatility index by month since last October. Now, in the orange line, we see all Jeppy's dividends paid. Now, as you can see here, you see an exact correlation. When the VIX are up, the dividends are up. When the VIX are tumbling, the dividends are tumbling. When the VIX are down, the dividends are down. When the VIX is spiked in the last month of September, we receive a little bit more in dividends from JEPI, guys. So next time you see these videos online saying that JEPI lost its touch, that JEPI is not a good form of investment to generate dividends, remember, guys, this is a cover called ETF. Therefore, it's going to be forever tied up to the volatility index. Now, is JEPI now a good option for you? Now that is up to you to decide. But in my case, I have JEPI, but I don't have the bulk of my money in JEPI. I have some money allocated to JEPI, and I have some other money allocated to other growth stocks, dividend stocks, and other investments that also generate good cash flow. Now, guys, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you found this video informative and hit the like button, subscribe, and share so other people can know this information as well. All right, thanks for watching, guys, and bye bye.